Good day everybody! This is Nel Carroco again and I have a very frustrated student in my Dilux Evo for Beginners course in Udemy and that is from Nishant Kumar Singh and Nishant said while calculating bath area my target value is 200 lux and achieve value is 236 lux but still showing red color please suggest you can see there is a screenshot here it's 236 but it says it's red here yeah Nishant is looking for a green light <laughs> please suggest what I will do as I face saying same for all okay and then I answered the overall uniformity is not achieved that's why it's red and um, remove the object or run the calculations without objects so how to do this suggestions I will show you how in my dialogue symbol here Okay, so I have a simple uh, toilet here. Yeah, it's a simple one. And I have lots of objects here. Yes, and if I run a calculation and Nishant, we have the same uh, requirement for this toilet and I also need to have 200 lux. So I'll go and calculate it. There you go. And let's see the value here yes i also got red light like it's a red one so it means i did not achieve the overall uniformity but i achieved the last value which is 240 lux and you can see it's only 0.29 that's why it's red okay so how to make it correct in your calculation report even though you still have object here all you need to do is go to these settings um you either go to the fast or not so I, for this tutorial, I will just go to the fast so I will not calculate the whole uh, other rooms on the other side also. So all you need to do is just click this one without object and furniture. And when you do that, recalculate. And now you will have, yes, you now have the green lights. So it means it is calculated without the object and furniture. The reason why the over your uniformity suffers is because you created a lot of object in the calculation areas and that may cause a zero on the report and if there are zero it, it's calculated as an overall as an average so you will not get the overall uniformity correctly and you will get a red light so that's the best way is yes calculate it without objects and furniture all right so Nishant, don't worry about it. Go and just click that calculation without object and you are good to go. All right, so I hope you learned something today. And uh, if you want to learn more, go and visit my Facebook, become my friend. Uh, I always give coupon codes here for my Udemy courses. And also check my Udemy courses about uh, Dialux Evo software, AutoCAD, um, Photoshop and other applications for lighting design. All right. I will upload more courses later on because I'm just busy with something else. All right. So see you again on the next video. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you will be updated with all my new videos and courses and books later on. All right. Bye-bye for now. Have a good day.